Hey guys, welcome to Guerrero's house. So today I have a very, 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 very exciting video for you guys. We are going to be playing with my royal family. I created a royal family and I built, well not really built, but I decorated a castle. And now I'm going to introduce you guys to two of the members in my royal family. They are currently in school. This is their school. They go to an elite and prestigious secondary school. So... This is what it looks like. I know I said secondary school and we have the American school buses out here. Just so ignore, ignore. Okay, thank you. <laughs> okay, so I did decorate this school a little bit more to my liking, but most of the decoration here is what came with the build. When I do have more time, though, I will customize it even more to my liking. Let's go on to class and meet the royal family. Okay, so... First, I'm going to introduce you guys to Dennis Middleton. Dennis is in the back of the classroom just like hating the fact that he has to be here. But this is Dennis and honestly like Dennis is just like super sad and I guess he's hurt by somebody. Um, so Dennis is just super sad because he's hurt by someone but this is Dennis. He is the prince. He's the first prince to our queen or the first grandson to our queen Sloan and we will meet her here shortly. But that is Dennis. He's just in class doing his work. And then my favorite is Miss Elizabeth here. She's in class. I mean, she hasn't really had a first good first day of school. This was her first day, but she got detention. So, I mean, that sucks for her. But, you know, you can't, you know. Yeah. So Elizabeth got detention and she's pretty upset about it. And, you know, Dennis is just sad in the back of the classroom just sitting there sad and this is these are the two princes and princess uh, this is these are the two princes and princesses of my royal family so let's go see what elizabeth is up to and as you guys can see they are wearing school uniform and the reason for that okay first of all this is a boy's bathroom this is a boy's bathroom ma'am i have to change that but yeah so the reason for why i really can't change it but so, the reason for why they are kind of upset or wearing a school uniform, because this is a private school, I did kind of want to play with like a regular American high school, but really there's nothing fun in that. <laughs> there's nothing fun in that, so I figured let me do something I've never experienced before, which is going to like an elite prestigious high school or secondary school. I have never um, gone to an elite secondary school, so this is very interesting. So, because... I'm gonna give put the bathroom here for boys only so that no one else can be walking in here like hello and then I'm gonna do one for girls only in the girls bathroom which is right over here I don't want them to intermingle this is a high school and high schoolers are just like something else so let's go here into the girls bathroom and I put that over there that is perfect I'm so sorry with my accent, you guys. I love to do that. I love to do that. So, what is she doing? Is she watching TV? Or is she, like... She's watching Diamonds Are For Sims. So, she's watching some sort of show right now. Instead of... She's in the staff room. Oh, my God. So, she's in the staff room instead of being in class. And she already got detention, but she's, like, embarrassed for some reason. I want to remove that buff, but honestly like so yeah my students are in school i'm gonna go ahead and switch control so but actually yeah so elizabeth is at school right now and look at her she is so pretty she is really the it girl i don't know why no one sat with her at lunch like i literally don't understand like all these guys are lame you guys are all lame because why did you not sit with elizabeth during lunch like wilder what's your problem I'm going to change the settings and I'm going to um, reset his height because he just looks so funny being so short. Like, And he's only short because he has a preteen mod. And here she's again watching TV in the staff room. So I'm going to just... Can I change the door settings? I don't think I can. So I'm going to get rid of the TV because you're not supposed to be in the staff room, sweetie. Staff room is only for teachers. Why are you here? You know? So let's get rid of this TV and sell. Um... Yeah, so this is my high school. I decorated very, very, very little here. And um, I like it so far. But, you know, so 
I like it so far. I'm gonna I'm gonna leave school early. I'm gonna leave school early because I don't have time for this. Okay, like I we're going home. Let's go home. Everyone's leaving school. Like if I leave school, everyone literally just leaves school. So bye bye everyone. Everyone's going home. I'm super happy to be home. <laughs> so let's go ahead and just change our outfits more choices oh my god there's uh, lots of choices so let's just go ahead and click on her and i'm gonna click on her and i'm gonna hit more choices and actually go back and i'm gonna click change outfit and i'm gonna put her in her every day and then i'm gonna click dennis to change his outfit and i'm gonna just put him in his every day so for every day the royals they wear like blue so they wear blues and whites in this household. And then for special occasions, you'll see them wearing red. Let's go ahead and meet everyone else in the royal family. We will start with Queen Sloan, wherever she is. Where are you? Here she is. So this is Queen Sloan, as you guys can see. She is famous. She is dressed in her cold weather attire. And she's actually picking up a book because I think she wants to go read. Most of the times, my sims do read because I do have like bookshelves literally everywhere love but this is queen soen queen soen is very very easygoing she's a very huge caring person like she loves people she loves her country and she'll do anything to make sure that everyone is happy in her country at least what she can do um so that is queen sloan she loves her grandchildren so yeah dennis and everyone else those are not her kids her kids actually died in an accident yeah so that means dennis and elizabeth as well as francesca and anne are her grandkids so she's a grandma <laughs> and then next we already met dennis you guys know who dennis is he's just out here playing golf and then we already met elizabeth i wonder what she's doing she's just in here um yikes her hairstyle changed elizabeth is just in here washing her hands let's go ahead and meet francesca francesca as you can see is a teenager she is just over here standing and yeah francesca is just a rebellious girl like she just wants to do what she wants to do she's never really gotten the whole royal thing so she doesn't really understand the importance of her role in her society well some people think it's because she's young but it's really just because she just doesn't want anything to do with being royal and then lastly we have anne middleton our lovely 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 anne i love anne she's really cute she's just a sweet little girl and yeah so that is my family so let me show you guys a tour of my castle so this is the front entrance of my castle um this is my front veranda i guess you could call it that and then let's zoom in here a little bit this is basically like my entryway that leads to the rest of the castle so the left wing of the castle is where we hold parties so this is our ballroom we have our bar over here and then if i rotate it this way we have our like coronation place or because um, we are going to have like coronations. I am planning for us to have like coronations and whatever royal people do, all that fun jazz. And then like for weddings, I want them held here. So we're going to have that here eventually if one of my sims do get married. Hopefully they do. So I'm really excited. And then on the right wing of the castle, we have the first floor, the first family floor. So now I... I'm doing like a first family type of thing. So the first, um, basically if I can explain it, is basically like, let's say Dennis or Elizabeth or Francesca and Anne or Anne, which you have not yet met. So if any of them, whoever is the first one in the royal family to get married and have children, they will get the first floor of the right wing. So this will be their main bedroom. This will be their main lounge area. So this will be their main bedroom. This will be their bedroom lounge area. This will be their bathroom. And then this will be their nursery to expand their family. And then it's the same thing for here for whatever kid they decide to have. So that's how that is the explanation for the right wing of the castle on the first floor so that is our first floor let's move on to floor numero dos upstairs over here we have our second floor we have this large beautiful chandelier hanging here this is so pretty you guys i enlarged it so that's why we have these like sparks here but you really can't notice and we have this like 
book area really I have no idea why I put this here I feel like it's just because I wanted to clutter up the castle but I didn't want to clutter it up like you would a regular household if you know what I mean so that's why I put this here and I find it really really cute the custom content for the window and everything even the shelves is in my Pinterest which will be linked down below I made a special board for you guys because everyone was asking me like where did you get that and I was like you know what like I always find my CC on Pinterest and I will put it on Pinterest for you guys so it is on Pinterest and then this is the same thing except over here we have this beautiful painting of whoever this lady is I have no idea and then we have a mirror a uh, window here and curtains and we have this like book area very really, really cute it's kind of just the same thing we have on this side except we have a photo in the middle now moving on to the left wing of the castle is like the recreational area so in this area the first room over here this is our gym it's very important for you to stay healthy and take care of your body so what better way to stay healthy than working out and making sure your body is nice and healthy so our royal family will participate in exercise and yoga and just wellness just to just to be healthy because you know guys health is very important then over here is just a blank room I'm still yet to figure out what I want to do with it maybe I'll make it an art room or something like that then over here we have the family um tv room the family theater it's very cute we have this large tv it's basically just a regular tv enlarged I actually want to change that okay then over here we have a bathroom and this bathroom actually it's not your finished building but um, I have a reason why I have a bathroom over here. This is the family music and ballet room. So this is where they practice dancing and they have someone who they hire to play the piano while they dance. And then over here, this would be the bathroom just because we have a gym on this side. And in here in the gym are two sinks and a fridge. The fridge is for getting any water when you're thirsty or healthy like drinks. Like I don't know, like seltzer water or sparkling water or something. And then we have hot towels in the gym too. Then moving on to the left wing of the house on the second floor is a family lounging area over here we just have the family room we have a fireplace and a table in the middle we just come here to sit and talk and just hang out with family just like be together the staff is not allowed to hang out in this area so it's not available to the staff they can only come in here to clean or if they really need to get to the kitchen that they can go to the kitchen but they cannot come in here to just like you know hang out then over here we have the family dining table the family is only allowed to dine on this dining table like the staff is not so they have to stand and dine somewhere else and moving on here we have the kitchen it's rare to see someone in the family be in the kitchen and actually cooking because we do have a live-in chef but on the rare occasion that they do cook because you know sims are always going to be sims and do stuff that you don't want them to do um, they'll be in here in the kitchen and this is my kitchen you guys um, I try to do minimal clutter I try to do very cute elegant clean type of look I don't, I've never been to a castle so I don't know what a castle looks like but in my head I imagine this is what it looks like <laughs> moving on out here we have like a patio area if you want to sit outside we normally sit out here for breakfast and just like talk or just you know see how everything's going how everyone's doing that's what we do sometimes and then we have the same thing over here like if you just want to sit and hang out with your friends it's what we do here and then on the top floor is where the royal family sleeps so this in the middle is the queen's study. The queen has a very, very important job, and that is to make sure that everyone is well taken care of. And this is her study. In her study, she just has like a laptop, a fireplace, and books all around her because she is an academic, yeah, figure or whatever. Um, so that is the queen's study. And then on the left wing, actually whoops that's right so in the right wing of the castle is where the royal family sleeps so this first bedroom belongs to princess elizabeth the second bedroom belongs to prince dennis and this third bedroom here belongs to the queen the queen has the biggest room in the house she has a room that leads to a closet and her closet eventually leads to a bathroom and then everyone else's room doesn't really have a bathroom because their royal family like in their culture is like only the queen gets a bathroom like a big private bathroom but so does all the other girls do so in this we have francesca's bedroom this is her room i will go into details like but you know it's just a repetition of 
the furniture that I have and we have this it matches this it's really really cute and then we have Francesca's bathroom which she has like this Mediterranean inspired bathroom it is beautiful I love this bathroom and she has a mirror here and blah 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 blah, blah. it's just so pretty then over here we have Anne's bathroom and then Anne's potty here because she is still a little girl but she do have a little toilet over here for when she does grow up for now she has a potty and then this is Anne's bedroom she has a crib as well as a regular toddler bed and then lastly we will go to the last floor which is all the way up here it is our servants quarter yes my servants quarter is at the top of the building instead of the bottom I felt like it was just very fitting for me to have my servants quarter at the top of our mansion castle um just because I like it. I like the vibe of the staff being all the way at the top and the staff being all the way at the bottom. We do love our staff here at the end of the day and you want them to be very comfortable because they do make everything easy going for us. In this side, we have um, the rooms. We have six women who are as part of our staff and then we have three men. But, you know, honestly, I... <laughs> Honestly, I'm going to assign this bed to our butler. I thought our butler was going to be a man, but it turns out our butler was a woman. So, um, I'm going to assign this bed to our butler. And where is she? I actually can't find our butler. And I have no idea why. So, I can't find our butler, but when I do find her, I will assign the bed to her. And yeah basically guys that is my tour that is my tour i'm gonna show you guys the mods i'm using i have the royal royalty mod i have not yet started it but i do have the royal castle as a lot trait so that is applied to my lot but i will update you guys on the royalty mod so that's my family um and that is my castle so, yeah. <laughs>